Hi, I'm Donna with Zo Packs, and I want to show you how to wrap a traditional pack of cigarettes. Today we're using the PXC12, and we have it outfitted with the optional accessory bar and the tear strip accessory. We're going to use gold tape today. You have the option of using clear. And first, I'm just going to quickly wrap a pack of cigarettes just to show you the gist of it. I'm making sure I've got it centered. And as I pull it across, we quickly do the sides nice and easy. But now I want to slow it down. I want to show you exactly what I'm doing here step by step. So we're taking the box and first we're going to make sure we're centering it on the film. And what I want to do is make sure I basically have equal amounts on either side of that. When I do my overlap here, this is the part that's going to fold over. I want it to be a little bit less than the depth of the box. So I'm going to center this and then I'm going to make sure I've got my thumbs pulled away. When you're working even with a small box like this, your tendency is to keep your thumbs up high. But we want to bring our thumbs a little bit farther back and we're going to do that consciously because once we start working with the heated elements that's going to be important. So with my thumbs back and I've got it centered, I'm going to take my index fingers and just press that edge against the box. Once I've got that pressed against the box, I'm sliding my fingers out of the way. So my fingers are now away from the edge of the box that's going to go across the heat panel but they're also still holding that piece of film intact. When I bring this across, I'm going to make sure that I have the tape centered in the forks, and then I'm just going to come down and press. Now, a couple things I want to point out about what just happened. As I'm bringing it across, I'm also taking this edge of the box that's toward me, and I'm dropping it down. I want to bring that so that it's coming down, because I want to touch this edge of the box against the heat panel before I touch this whole side. And a tendency is to put a lot of focus on the wire when you're doing this. Because the wire is hot and that's what actually cuts this piece of film away from the roll. But the problem is, is if we're focusing too much on the wire, we're not doing it in a smooth motion. So we're going to bring it across. We're going to make sure that the tape is centered in the fork and we're just going to ignore the wire and just tap here and press. And you can see when I do that, it gives us this nice clean seal. And we're going to move on to these end pieces. So to get these ends folded in, we're going to use our index fingers and press just like so. And you can see I create two flaps when I do that. We're going to focus on those flaps one at a time. So I do this to create the flaps and then I roll my fingers out of the way and roll that flap out of the way. We're going to focus on this first one. So we're going to tap and then flatten and then we're going to tap and flatten. Perfect mitered edge. Let's do that again. We're going to press using our index fingers. We're going to roll one of those flaps out of the way and then we're going to tap and roll and then we're going to tap and roll. Real nice tight wrapping on that. And we've got this little piece of the tear tape that sticks up, which makes it real easy for you just to pull it and open your pack. Now you can get everything you see here at zopacks.com and you can also watch more of our videos at YouTube. Just search Zopacks. Thanks.